right? And let's flick on down here and see what would happen if we decided to put another large high school down here. I know these are expensive, but I think it will be worth it to have educated little bastards. Otherwise known as ELBs. Alright, blow you up. Wrong. We are going to put you right there. And yes, residential zones can fill out the rest. It's kind of in a chasm here. That's pretty funny. And we are going to call this South High School. Nice. Now when we look at education, it pretty much fits everyone. I am a little bit paranoid about, you know, the elementary school thing, so what if we put in a large elementary school up here somewhere? About right there. Okay. Well, let's put one down there. I don't think we need both everywhere. I'm going to run with that theory because although I've heard that from everyone or from people, I haven't really seen too much that it was based on. So we're just going to go with that. Including blowing up that ugly house. Okay. Shut up. Ooh, we got a courtyard. Or court grounds, or whatever it's called. Worry about that later. Alright, so if my calculations are correct, that should cover education. Now we're gonna look at health. Nobody's healthy. Everyone thinks living here is really unhealthy. But we're gonna research large medical centers. Alright, first we're gonna put one in this general area. Alright. This is a 4x4, four four, I think it is. So we're just gonna... Boom! Smack you down. Well, it's only a 3x3, three three, it turns out. So I'm going to have to write apology letters to everyone's house who I destroyed unnecessarily. How sad. Alright. Now that we have that, it almost seems like we're going to be doing this somewhat like the high schools, except, like, not. So if you're there, we should have him be on the same latitude, so to speak. Because industrial workers, they might have to go there as well. So we'll blow you up. Put you right there. That should uh, work out fine for all of you. Now we need one in this quadrant. Shut up, shut up. I think putting it next to the middle school, or the middle school, I'm saying the minor league field is fine. <laughs> Minor League is the middle school of baseball. You can put my name on that statement, I guess. It occurs to me, does this railroad have a station over here? It doesn't. I'm thinking we need to fix that. So, railroad station. And let's... Zone and apartment complex. This isn't going to be an attractive site because people can jump right on the train. It's going to be cool. Alright, one more hospital. We'll be up here. Alright, let's zoom out. Ooh, university. 
We'll accept that, but we'll uh, build it later if we there's room. Or, well, I mean, we can make room, obviously. Yeah, right there is good. So... There we go. There's our hospital. And our entire city is covered. Let's uh, speed things up so that the changes take place. Ooh, we can worry about that later. Alright. Yeah, we probably need to do cemetery because people are dying left and right in our city. Despite our best efforts. Are we still getting money? Yes, we are still getting money. It's quite a bit of money, too. Alright. Let's just sit back and let everything sort of squeeze forward into to, uh, the year 24. And then we will evaluate the effects of these um, changes upon our city. Because I think it's going to be quite positive. I think everyone is going to be uh, quite happy with them. Because everyone likes to live in this beautiful city of Gab Wubby, which is the best name ever. All right, we're going slower now, and we're going to take a, take a look at crime. Crime seems a lot lower. Education, still red, but that takes time. Uh, quiet health. Again, not too good, but that takes time. Water, if we want to still have water, good. And fire hazard. We got everyone covered. All right, now let's take a look at our budget. We're clearly spending a lot more, but we're still making a profit. So let's take a look at health and education. Health. Does everyone have everything they need? Okay, uh, you really don't. Bump you up. Bump you up even more. Bump you up a little bit. Bump you up more. Alright. Education. You're all fine. I could even do to tune you down a little bit. It seems like everyone's going to these elementary schools if they can. So... We're going to turn you down just a little bit. And that's fine for now. Okay, utilities. Everything's fine. Everything's great. Everything's groovy. Actually, now that we're here, we might as well look at the um, public safety, fire department. Yeah, you're all fine. Police department. Yeah, you're all fine. Everyone's doing great. We're just going to go to the year 25 to let those further changes take effect. Yeah, it's quite, uh, quite wonderful how that's all going. How everything's going so well in our city. Ooh, statue. We'll worry about that in a minute here. Alright, let's slow things down again once we get 25. Yeah. Alright, let's take a look at some of the gifts that have been offered to us. First of all, a house of worship. Well, not too much can fit here, so there. There's your freaking church. Impressive mayor statue. Well, if we look in this town, the center would be... Alright, where should we put this impressive mayor statue? I say right here, so we can see it from the highway. Ooh, another impressive mayor statue. Oh, right, right by the bridge. Yeah, that's what I say. Everyone needs to see my likeness. No matter where the heck they are. Alright. Fine, we'll give you another freaking church. And we'll put it on the mountainside. It's always fun how you can fit these things in the oddest of places. For some reason. Who else? University. Alright, we need somewhere with low land value. Oh, look how higher land value's gotten everywhere. Over here is not too high. 
All right, here's what we're gonna do. Come on. Uh, click. Oh. Boom. You're all gone. University. Oh, except for you. Apparently, you're still sticking around. University and click a doodle. We have the University of Gabwabi. We're going to call this. Uh, what are we going to call it? Jimmy Rollins University. That's right. This university can hit more home runs than anybody. All right. Let's just uh, go to the year 26 to allow that. <gasps> and other changes to um, take effect in our beautiful city. Yeah, yeah, everyone needs room to do everything. That's just the way of the world, isn't it? Oh, man. And our population has been uh, creeping upward, I noticed. Oh, man, let's slow it down. Let's see, number of students, student capacity. We have plenty of room. And no one's cut a class. Wow. That's pretty impressive. Let's take a look at traffic while we can. Hey, there's no traffic anywhere. I guess our uh, road system paid off. Alright. Let's take a look at our jobs and population. Hey, look at this. We've had a boom in middle class jobs. We've had a drop in low wealth stuffs, and we've had a rise in we've had a rise in dirty industry, but manufacturing, and even high tech, is starting to make a uh, showing in our city. Yeah, you could say we're doing well for ourselves here. Oh man, I almost feel like naming streets, but I should do that off camera. Oh man, I have named all the east-west streets numerically, and that's good enough for now. It's quite wonderful to have those all named, because people like living on streets with names, so they know where the hell they are and such. Look, still no traffic. Oh, no wonder people don't know where they are, or they do know where they are now. Kind of interested if there's any uh, passenger train traffic. Well, maybe the tiniest amount. Yeah, there's 57 passengers there. How many are actually going to the neighboring city? 101 are going to McVailsburg, where your mom is the glorious mayor. Is anyone driving there on the highway? Yeah, people are driving to McVailsburg on the highway, too. It's, um... <clears throat> it's quite a wonderful thing. All right, the next thing we're going to do is look at desirability and see where stuff can go. The city of Gab Wubby wants to expand, and since it can't expand out anymore, it can expand up. So let's look at, let's see what's the most desirable. Hmm, industry. Well, they can build high-tech plants somewhere, can't they? Hmm. What area is not being utilized? Well, this all looks too nice to really want to do anything with, except over here. This area is kind of iffy, so... There we go. We're going to say Surprise Industrial District. Alright. Hopefully that will be all be high-tech and we can all be happy. And high-wealth residential. Everywhere. So let's concentrate on one area at a time. We can't really build high density in a city such as this. At least not at the moment. So let's concentrate on zoning up and seeing what happens. Alright. Actually, let's cut right to um, high wealth office because that's a little bit more exclusive and we can zone around that. Well, it looks like this area is the most desirable. So, 
We are going to... No, we don't need to do that. Where are we going to find? Just demolish those. And say... This is what we're doing now. And see, the developers are already jumping on it. And they're probably going to build low wealth stuff because, well, let's face it, that's what they do. Alright. I'm going to try squeezing some high wealth or high density in over here. Some commercial in there. This could be like the main commercial district. The main commercial drag, if you will. Very nice. Well, not really, but eventually it will be. Yes, we are going to bring Gab Webby into the future. So, there's a surprising dot up here. Right in this area. Well, we already have our industrial zones there. So, whoa, hello. What if we... Now, we kind of screwed this all up, didn't we? Yeah, this is kind of gnarly. But... Alright. We're just going to make this high density all throughout here. Just dezone you start over. Not like we really got much more out of that we started with, but whatever. Now yeah, we're gonna bring this city into the future. Or at the very least we're gonna drag it into the present, and that is all that can be expected for some of these places. Oh come on, you were giving me more before. Oh, that's what I get for being greedy, I guess. Oh, man. Let's turn on the speed. Let it zone it all in, even though it's probably going to be uh, not too exciting at first. But it should uh, become nicer as it goes along. For instance, this. That's high tech. And take a look at that. That's high tech. And how about this? High tech. And you. Well, you're medium wealth, but that's a step in the right direction. Yes, we have manufacturing here. We have manufacturing. What's building now? High tech. Why did I tell you, folks? High tech's being built. It's wonderful.